after post covid the technology uh, uh, is into each and every one all the students all the parents all the teachers and the only thing lacking right now is that lot of training is not being given to the teachers now uh, students are very smart these days like in our when we were studying no i did my schooling from methodist high school kanpur only we had never seen computers ha na and uh, suddenly uh, when this technology came so we were updated we kept on taking some sort of trainings from intel i remember when i was in cms we were given training on intel we may, used to make projects and all everything now the students have been exposed to all this uh, things in a very early stage the only thing that is lacking is teachers training and how to do it how to train each and every uh, teacher because when when a teacher is taking a class now she should always have an uh, uh, be in a very positive attitude and the, uh, uh, she should always remember that uh, children are out more smarter than her she should be prepared with all the lesson plans and all these things and uh, the other thing is how to keep the children safe from uh, internet how 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 is that technology how are we going to tell help help from other like uh, sir was speaking right now your special guest and uh, he has some device so he must be having something uh, for this also ha na like uh, misuse of internet should not be there now the, an- another thing is that um, lot of things have been um, as students they learn uh, very useful life skills practical skills as well as life skills as well as including creating uh, presentations learning to differentiate between reliable and unreliable sources that is very important for well, how do they come to know whether this is a reliable source or this is not a reliable source who is going to guide them in terms of learning experience offers us lot of uh, opportunities to build connection and share the ideas beyond our immediate circles now that is also a very good thing like uh, we are very used to uh, people who are always around us but uh, 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 when we enter this uh, integrated uh, uh, technology we get a wider space wider circle a uh, lot of uh, uh, a lot of exposure is given to us we, uh, uh, it also encourages uh, fun to learning also and to encourage uh, collaboration and improves team work it improves a lot of team work common challenges and concerns when integrating technology is student misusing technology teachers knowledge and uh, professional development uh keeping students safe online uh cost of technology now this is a very important uh, this thing and uh, keeping up with changes now this is another challenge since this uh, being a, um, a very challenging um, a technology every day one has to be very updated on what is coming new because it might be possible that when the teacher is in the classroom the students are more updated more updated so one has to be uh, a little more updated lot of training people should come out i don't know why um, like there are so many trainings uh, in cbsc also going on uh, i'm not challenging anyone so please don't uh, anyone listening don't take it to that but lot of training on integrating uh, technology should be done for each and every one whether it whether they are students whether even the management even the manager of the school sometimes it uh, becomes very difficult for the principal to make the management understand all these points because where cost effectiveness come we have to uh, look forward to the management and generating Ma'am. a lot of uh, like uh, 3d uh, boards are now there in the market 3d boards now uh, if you remember when we used to uh, i been a teacher myself we used to prepare our lesson plans we used to have lot of teaching aids teaching aids and um, flash cards so many things we used to have now that engaging the children in the classroom is a very uh, crucial point like 40 students sitting in a class you have to engage each and every one and now that thing is here because audio and visual 
um, like our um, uh, parents and all, everyone, when we attend PTMs and all, they come to meet us. Ma'am, how the children learn the movie? How do they learn the songs? Why? Because the audio visual is there. So this audio and visual both to, uh, together working in the classroom gives a lot of um, a lot of focus on the students and every child is focused just on the board to see what is going to come next. 